Hello, this is Bryce with Timberframe HQ. And in this short video, we're going to talk about what comes in a Timberframe house kit or package and review some of the options that the Timberframe companies may have for you. Now, while each company will provide different options and solutions for you, we feel that these are the general components that will help you get started on the right path. So the first component is design and engineering. This will often happen within the Timberframe company. However, they may outsource one or both of these tasks to a timber frame designer or engineer. Whoever does the work, it's important that you make sure they check with the local building department to find out exactly what is needed in your area before they start building. The second component is the actual timber frame. Now whether it's hand cut or machine cut, the timber frame company would generally provide the timbers, fasteners, and other items to raise the frame. The companies usually include the installation of the timber frame. However, it's important to check with them and make sure that this is included in the package and if there's any other options to think about. As a quick tip, make sure you ask if there's any other associated costs with the raising such as the crane, forklift rentals, or any extra materials needed for the raising. It never hurts to ask up front as these sometimes are very large expenses. The third component is the tongue and groove, or TNG, decking that usually goes over the roof of a timber frame. So as you look up, you see a nice wood finish, similar to what you see in the background. As with the raising of the timber frame, the installation of the TNG may be an option, but it's a good idea to get it with the timber frame as it will save you both time and money. The fourth component, and usually the final one provided by the timber frame company, are there structural insulated panels or SIPs? These large panels wrap the outside of a timber framing, providing timber frame, providing both the insulation and stru structural elements to hang the drywall, exterior siding, and provide the subsurface for your roofing material. Each timber frame company you talk to will have a slightly different take on SIPs and SIP companies, so make sure you research them so you know what you're getting the right panel that suits your timber frame. Well, those are the four major components that go into a timber frame house kit. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And we certainly hope that you're able to take something away that will help you in your timber frame project. And remember, if you have any other questions about timber frame house kits or packages, or if you're just looking for a timber frame house, split for, house plan for yourself, make sure you check out our website at timberframehq.com. And don't forget to say hi to us at facebook.com backslash timberframehq. Take care, and thanks for watching.